in a historical movie. Oh, this is the only one on the test. I changed the wording just a little bit so you can see if you can. Uh, I didn't. It doesn't actually like affect the problem, but you can see if you catch the difference. Uh, Sir, whatever, whatever. Yeah, two knights on horseback start from rest, eighty-eight meters apart, and ride directly toward each other. Yes. Um, ride directly toward each other to do battle. Sir George's acceleration has a magnitude of 0 0.3 meters per second squared, while Sir Alfred's has a magnitude of 0 0.2 meters per second. Relative to Sir George's starting point, where do the knights collide? Okay, so we are looking for a position. So we use the position equation. Uh, yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so. Every day. Oh, I do want to point out because I, I caught it after. Up there it says plus C for like a starting height. On the test, I put plus H. It doesn't matter, but I noticed I'd switch the letters. Um, so anyway, what we know is that the, the distance that the two of them travel together is going to equal 88 meters. So like if they're covering 88 meters between the two of them, that's how far they're going to travel when they meet. So we can set this thing equal to 88. Uh, so 88 is going to equal what Sir George does, so we'll put one half his acceleration t squared. Um, he didn't have a starting velocity, and we don't have like a starting height or anything. And then what Sir Alfred does, uh, so that was George. That the formula has one half. No, I'm talking about the second part. Zero point. That's Alfred. So oh, okay. George and Alfred together are going to cover 88. Um, okay. So 88 equals 0 0.15 t squared plus 0 0.1 t squared. So then 88 equals 0 0.25 t squared. Um, we can divide both sides by 0 0.25, which gives us 352 equals t squared. And if we take the square root, Yeah. 18, 18. What? I got point seven six. Yeah, I got seven six. Oh, okay. That's an impressive guess. Then. Okay. Now, the question asked for relative to George's position, how far, and that's a time. So all you have to do is take that time and put it back in to the equation for George. So 1 half, 0 0.3, okay, not off. 18.8 squared. Thirteen point eight. Times point three times point seven. And eighteen point eight. 
Okay, and so that comes out to 53 meters, which makes sense that the guy going a little bit faster is a little bit more than halfway when they spear each other. <laughs>